Well, this video is some of the cutest I've seen in quite a while. The National Park Service says this kitten boom is great news, especially considering that area of the Santa Monica Mountains burned two years ago in the Woolsey fire. They all seem to be in really good health. Furry, adorable faces, 13 mountain lion kittens born in the Santa Monica Mountains and Simi Hills. Since May, biologists with the National Park Service have discovered five different dens. They say they've never seen so many dens in that area in such a short period of time in the 18 years they've been studying them. Public Affairs Officer Ana Beatriz Cholo. You could see how mountain lion mothers are so attentive and such good moms. Cameras capture their movements. Researchers perform general health checks on each kitten while the mother is away hunting for food. A tag is placed on each one to help identify them in the future. So the research has been invaluable and we're learning more and more with each year. So why so many kittens this year? Cholo says researchers don't know, but it's something they're studying. We do know the lockdown across the state in some instances has benefited wildlife. A study by the Road Ecology Center at the University of California, Davis, found a significant drop in traffic after the emergency order went into effect in March. The number of animals killed by vehicles also fell, including a 58% drop in fatal crashes involving mountain lions between the 10 weeks before and 10 weeks after the order. But Cholo says it's too soon to say whether the pandemic has had any effect on mountain lion behavior. We haven't found the evidence yet. It doesn't mean to say that we won't, but we haven't found it as of yet. Mountain lion mothers typically raise their offspring for about a year and a half. One of the moms who just gave birth is named P-19. They've been following her since she was a baby. She's been a mom for a number of times, and so I think her last litter was in the summer of 2018. So she didn't get much of a break. 2018 was also the year of the Woolsey fire. Cholo says it destroyed about 90% of their federal park land and about half of the recreation area. They lost two mountain lions they were studying in that fire. But they did receive some good news when they discovered one of the new moms this year, named P65, is a three and a half year old mountain lion who survived that fire. This is a great sign. This is an amazing sign of life and we're just, we're thrilled to see it. Kelly Hesedal, News 8.